What's up, everybody? We're back with some more Overdrift. Yeah! There we go. <laughs> Before we begin, I would like to thank uh, Erdy, Magikos, and Nadawa for being members of our Patreon. If you'd like to be members of our Patreon, you can go to patreon.com. So I'll just link in the description. Today, I'm going to try to right the wrongs of last episode, where I had a good build, and then I ruined it with hubris. But uh, then I couldn't get it going again because it's hard. Yeah. Uh, okay, here's my problem. I guess I'm gonna go with Pulse, because it's like, I want a weapon to start out with. I'm gonna be throwing it away when I get heavy, or, uh, hidden power. But, I don't want to waste a reroll on getting a good weapon. I, but I wanted to start with Flak, because that's the best starting weapon, but Pulse should do just fine. Break all the rocks. <laughs> Bonk. I may have gotten a little bonk. Just a little bonk. You, like, stared at it. And we're, going, just like... we're going back with the reflect shield. Yeah. So, there's also some things that people have said, you know, and things you know, that I observed myself throughout the run that I, you know, I'm going to be making some slight alterations. Uh, I will be going Omni Shield because, like, the, the whole build is pretty much based in my shield. So, might as well lean into it. Yeah. Because uh, once the shield goes down, then I'll never get that shield back. Just ever. So I just might as well not let it break in the first place. Exactly. Uh, and another thing is a new beta just came out where they changed a couple of things around, and I can show them off in this build. Oh, careful. Yeah, assuming I don't die to everything else. Uh, let's regeneration. Ally specialist. Uh, regenerative shields. Stop shooting stuff. Yeah, you just stay there and die. Like a, like a good boy. Oh, it's so one little... Nubbin. Yep. <laughs> uh, bravado. Om almost always want that when you're using the snake body because it's so good with Leviathan. Unless you're doing very specifically the build we're doing today. <laughs> oh, yeah? Oh, yeah, because... Because it's going to improve my hull, which I don't care about. I'm going to be throwing away... Most of the hull. Just all of my hull. Uh, and then I'm going to do the other obvious thing when you do a shield build, like a fallen shield build, is I'm going to get... Uh, Gemini Protocol and Adrenal Module, which will allow me to do even more damage. Boost! Oh, but it's a little baby boost. That's okay. It's still better than nothing. Oh, but there's also three levels in that. Yeah. Uh, let's see. I want both Barrier and Candescence, but I'm going to get Barrier first because that's going to lead into Omni Shield. Uh, I think I'm going to... Oof. Energized Shield is probably rare, but I also want Efficiency and Shield Cooldown. Yeah. Uh, shield cooldown is not that big of a deal because, well, it is because, uh, yeah, it regens faster. Yeah. Uh, efficiency is going to be very good. Uh, but I'm going to get energized energize shield, energize shield because it's less common. Yep. And, and it's shield cooldown, so. Yeah, but it's 5% compared to 20%. Like it's yeah, but you'll get, you'll get the other ones eventually. And then efficiency is 20% also. Yep. But energy well, shields. I'm actually gonna get shield cooldown. Okay. I know. I I I talked myself in and out of like twelve different things there. Yeah, you did. And then Omni Shield. All right. We're we're fully in it now. So now, uh, the main wild mod we want to find is uh, Galvanic Outburst. Mm, just reflect those back. Um, again, like, I think that's good, but I don't think it's as good as some other things. I'm going to get Candescence going, because if I can get, uh, uh, Corrosion and Purification going, that would be very strong. Uh, Purge isn't bad either, but I th think I like Corrosion more. Now, dumb question. Yes. Uh, why this tree at all at the moment? 
uh, because I'm going to be getting the burning trail and the the burning stuff to show it off, and galvanic outburst is all burn damage. Ah, there you go. Uh, but I think I'm gonna reroll that. Uh, I have some decent options here. Reflective shield is good. Radiant shield is good. Another thing people kept pointing out is. Increasing the radius of my shield is good because Galvanic Outburst's damage, or, like, arc, is based on shield radius. Ah. But, yes. Gotta try to find some Galvanic Outbursts. Uh, I'm going to get Kinetic uh, soon because that leads into Aegis. And then from Aegis, I can get Sanctuary. And this is a build I want Sanctuary, again, because I don't want my shield to break at all. No, don't you. Um, this is pretty good. Anyone that's in my weaponized shield radius takes more damage. Yep. Uh, I really wish I had Galvanic at this point. But... We gotta do another boost. What we got, what, what we can. Grand uh, Grandier is fantastic for Leviathan again. In any other build but this, I'm gonna reroll. Uh, Adrenal module is something that we're going to want, but Scorching Wake is one of the things I want to show off, and that's rare. You're also right in the middle of a boost. I am right in the middle of a boost, and Scorching Wake looks very good in a boost. Which yeah, it does. To say. In the boost tier list, which we gotta do again anyway, because frickin' Kaviric changed all the boosts the yeah. second we did it. Oh, it was good, though. He, he was waiting. <laughs> uh, so the change to Scorching Wake is uh, two-thirds of all the fireballs that come out come off of random segments instead of just the head segment. Uh, and the other change is the the trailing wake, uh, whatever, whatever wake. it's called, deadly wake, uh, comes off of the tail end of the snake instead of the head, which makes more sense. Yes. Alright, so now, yeah, they come off all the little bits and bobs of my body. Okay. That's uh, cool. Ally Specialist. Uh, kinetic Boost, because I want to get Sanctuary going. Okay. Okay, so my, my next concern, as always with the Leviathan, is that, uh... I still got uh, Station Omega to deal with. Mm hmm. Station, Station Omega is the kind of kind of thing where it's like uh, you you'll either destroy him very quickly or you'll have a problem. Yeah, and in a perfect world, I can also get Phantom Strike. An another thing, other people pointed out, I should get Phantom Strike even if I'm not planning on doing weapon hits, just because it bounces you to the other side of them and you can start wrecking face. Mm hmm. Uh, let's see. Uh, efficiency and skirmish are both good for what I'm doing. Uh, I want to get efficiency because I want to get Gemini Protocol. Uh, let's see. Another thing people have mentioned uh, is that getting uh, Maelstrom isn't worthless because it would bend the bullets around my head, which is the vulnerable section of my body. Which is true, but they also sometimes bend bullets right into my body, or right into my head, that would have otherwise missed, so it's give or take, but I do think by and large it's probably better. Let's see, we'll get an adrenal module, so now the second uh, Gemini protocol comes up, we'll be doing more damage. Still haven't found Galvanic Outburst yet. Okay, here's, here's where the fun begins. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna need you to Die quickly, please. Thank you. <laughs> it's a real gambit. Corrosion. We'll take corrosion. Again, this will all be much better when I get, you know, the, the key talent for the build. Galvanic Outburst. You want to take some obsession and set up for it? Obsession is scary. Well, go to Obsession for just a second. Don't actually have to take it. Just hover over it a minute. One percent Hall and Shields. Reach wild mod you own. Yep. Okay. So it can get a little scary, yeah. Like, it's good. It's very good. Yeah. 
It's, it is, so, yeah. Uh, it, it's, it. it's dangerous, but it saves you, it saves you time. Well, look, I'm, I'm finding so many galvanic uh, outbursts, like, I want the ones that I find to, to be worth more. Yeah. Uh, also, if I find an honor bound, I'm going to also take that in a heartbeat. Just so I can hope that I can get three whenever they show up. Yeah. Uh, skirmish. Skirmish is fine. Alright. These guys are always a pain in the ass. Yeah. Shooting back his own bullets. Yep. You take them. I don't want them. Hey, Galvanic hey, there outbursts. There you go. Just two Galvanic outbursts. So now I'm going to be zapping. Uh, so, Phantom Strike, Blink is another possibility. I can blink into stuff. Phantom Strike is a little bit more efficient. And then I can just shoot people back with their own bullets. Yeah. Ooh. Purification. Ooh, yeah. But Aegis is good too uh, because it blocks the other thing. I want to be sanctu sanctuaried. You want to be sanctioned? Yeah. Oh, really volleyed that one. Uh, and then I need some more offensive defensive talent so that hidden power comes up. If I don't have enough already, I haven't been paying attention to how many I have. Um, bare minimum, you've got Scorching Wake, you've got, um... Galvanic Outburst. Galvanic Outburst. Ah, well, Phantom Strike. Yeah. Say, I'm, I'm still not 100% sure what mods all count for, uh, Hidden Power. Um, like Phantom Strike. Does Phantom Strike count? It's... Uh, it's technically not an attack in and of itself. Got him. <laughs> That's why Phantom Strike is good with Leviathan. Yeah. In case you're curious. Reflexive shields would. Uh, Terminate's also sure. good, especially with Punchy coming up. Yeah. Uh, well, Terminate's good in general, but... I'm going to get Reflexive Shield just because I want to get hit in power. Yes. And, and I know that's going to help trigger it. Because I don't need this weapon. This weapon is not what I'm about. No. It is a temporary measure. It's, it's a crutch. Of all these mines. You can look at this guy and be like, zip, zap. And then we can look at this guy and be like, zap, zip. <laughs> Hidden power. Oh, scorching wake. I know, right? But hidden power, for God's sakes. Well, your shield is taking a bit of a beating there. Yeah, that's, I mean, I. The other reason I want to get sanctuary going at some point. <clears throat> uh, did I ever end up getting efficiency yet? Oh yeah. I did. Yep. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's see. Ba, 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 ba. Uh, there's Aegis. Yeah, I'm looking at Aegis. I'm just. Oh, yeah, there's a thing right yeah. there. I was just like, I don't remember taking it, but my memory is <clears> poor. <throat> oh, Giant protocols there. Like, they love giving me just everything I want at once. Like, there's four talents here that I would love. Yeah, but you need Aegis. Uh, oh, I had a second, I had a second uh, hmm. thing there. I also uh, got 16 rerolls. I can get improved thrusters to get Deadly Wake, but I feel like that's. Super. That's a, that's a nice secondary thing. Uh, emergency systems is fine, but I don't want to lose my thing anyway. I'm gonna yeah. get my protocol because that's the 
Oh, oh boy, oh okay. boy. Okay. That was, uh... Oh, okay, she looks back. <laughs> Sanctuary. Sanctuary! Lots more shields, and now it just regenerates. Okay, now, now we can start having some fun. Now, now everything's starting to come together. You still take a ton of... Oh, got my you need, you need, I think you need barrier at some point here as well. Uh, that's uh, I have barrier because yeah, you do. Yep, because the sanctuary. One of the things I need to get sanctuary is barrier. It's barrier. Okay. Look out, man! Just... first. <laughs> Protect your head for a second there. Yeah. Because your shield still feels like it's taking way too much damage to be safe. I'm not playing particularly defensively at the moment. Yeah. Honor bound. <laughs> Which, again, honor bound doesn't uh, save you. If you've already got obsession, yeah. it doesn't actually save you mods. Also, boost! I don't think <laughs> I said it. Um, but it does make... It, it, it turns it, that the, that talent into a galvanic outburst eventually. Correct. It, it turns it into a future. It's it, it 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 helps with the consistency. Yeah. <laughs> I love use my tail to just bat people. And see you later. That just feels mean. <laughs> because like, it is mean. Like what did Punchy Magoo ever do to you? Uh, he tried to punch me. He didn't though. He, sh he showed up. Hey guys, what's going on in Hokon? <laughs> and he got punched. Uh, deadly wake. I get them improved thrusters. No, I'm gonna. I'm gonna get terminate uh, or adaptive armor. Adaptive armor is probably the smart option here. Uh, yeah, let's let's start. Get some defensive talents going here. Yeah, let's start being more defensive. -y. You're clearly already very strong. It's, you need, now you just need to be tough. Tonk tough. Just kind of get in their way before they can reach the main screen. Uh, something like that. Oh, I like my tail. Like, what? You just like yeah. caress it? Yeah. Lovingly. Like a cat that like rubs. Oh man. Uh, no. Because uh, I need, I need both channeling. of these. I need channeling and rebuke. Do you want rebuke? I don't have a weapon, so I can this just 110% armor stack duration, and I can fire it. I can choose to oh, fire it. Oh, that's true. That's true. Uh, but this is going to improve my regeneration. You which is huge. Yeah. But yes, make no mistake. I absolutely want both. Stop running away from me. <laughs> Don't be mean. <laughs> also, stop hitting yourself. Alright, now I'll finally get Terminate. Everything exploded there. Yes. So, this... This is... Back to roughly where I was the the last time we did this. Yeah, give or take. Give or take. Uh, yeah, we'll grab rebuke here. Uh, scorch another scorching wake would be nice. Uh, it would be two it, scorching. Well, before scorching wakes. So. Which would be good. Yeah. But I assume you want to save it for Galvanic if you can. Yep. And rebuke again. I wanted it anyway. Then we'll get core shielding at some point. Just to like our let our armor stack even longer. Yep. Stay as protected as possible. Just zap everybody. Uh 
So other than potentially grabbing Deadly Wake, is there any, like, essential something I'm missing? I don't think so. You've got pretty much everything. Core shielding is the other one, yeah. Yeah. It's gonna give me plus five base shield and plus five base hull. Yeah. And a bunch of self-damage resistance to the self-damage I don't do. You could. I don't wanna. Everything's already scary. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I, got, I got a squaggly tail there for a second. Yeah, sent home with your tail between your legs. Oh, I, mean, that was just... oh, I gotta try to get him quick. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, no, stay away. <laughs> yeah, that attack is oh. potentially devastating. Oh, I reflected that right back at him. Aw, oh, you dodged me. Get back sort, here. Sort of what he does. <laughs> uh, I, again, I don't want four of you scorching wake. You got 16 rerolls. Yeah, I know. Well. <laughs> Deadly wake. Uh, uh, burning. Uh, burning. Dying thunder. star. Jesus. <laughs> there you go. You really struggled on that burning, one. Burning, erupting, burning finger. Um, I could just go for three galvanic outbursts. Just burn all 15 rerolls? Well, this... Oh, yeah, that would lose all of my rerolls. That's yeah, probably not worth it, especially when I can just reroll and... There you go. Get all of them right there. I think picking that up at some point is not necessarily a terrible idea, but... When you got 16 rerolls, you might as well just reroll looking for it. Okay. Oh yeah, that's that's a good amount of uh, galvanic outbursting. That's not bad. These guys, I feel like I can just kind of defensive curl, let them kill themselves. Uh, let's see. So, like, improved thrusters isn't bad going towards Deadly Wake and maybe Blink uh, getting energized. Yeah. Energized I, I, shields is not bad. I like the idea of both Deadly Wake to show off the new thing and, you know, Blink is good. I considered energized shields, but I was like, eh, it's okay. It's only 5%, which, I mean, when you have all of the other ones, it's not bad, because, you know, it's more than zero. Yeah. Doing what you want. But it's not its not a fantastic amount. Let's see, make sure I get all my XPs. Don't want to lose none. Oh, I'm close to level... Well, Deadly Wake. Look at it burn from my tail. That looks so good. It, it looks so much better coming from the tail than it did coming from the back of my head. Which, I have to ask, do we know... Did that? Did this update also change the... Uh, the blade coming out of the back of your neck with propulsive munitions? Uh, as far as I can tell, no, but I haven't tested it, but it, that certainly was not in the patch notes. Okay. Because that would be crazy, too, if you're, if the propulsive munitions was also coming out of the tip of your tail. Although, I think that would be so much harder to control. Oh, absolutely. But it'd be fun. <laughs> Stop shooting your weapons. Oh, singularity going that way. I like how my, my head is affected by the singularity, but the rest of my body isn't. Oh, well, see you later, guys. It's, you know. Oh, well, bye. Physics. These teleports are supposed to be like 
new scary ways for things to show up on the field. And yeah. you're just like, because Leviathan, <laughs> murder. Well, it's not because Leviathan. It's because of Domni Shield and Sanctuary and Galvanic Outburst and et cetera and so on. But also Leviathan. Like, I, I take less body damage. So that probably helps. Uh, yeah, 16, do I just re yeah, yeah, 16 rerolls. Oh, oh well, Maelstrom. Maelstrom. Mm. The people have spoken. They want me to Maelstrom. So I'll Maelstrom. Plus it's Maelstrom. Got him. Got him again. <laughs> I do like when they blink in like that. Gives me a second to get in position. I do like it when they come onto the screen like that. <laughs> yeah. Whew. Alright. You can theoretically take rampages. It would offset the obsession by a fair bit. But it would mean that I'm gonna I'm gonna start oh, going so like the Dickens. Going. Yeah. But it increases my hull and shields. It's true. And you do more damage. It's true. I mean, I don't know what else really I can be taking. Like, blink, but meh. Let's do it. Is there anything else we can take that would mitigate damage in any way? Mitigate damage? I think we have all the damage mitigation we're going to get. Unless I'm forgetting something. Mm. Da -da 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 -da. Just bop. Yeah. Bop it, twist it, and pull it. So if I do this build well and no, oh, well it is boost. Yeah. <laughs> James, you're slacking. I'm sorry. Um but yeah, if I do this build well and don't die to hubris, I mean I feel like I can't call this the hubris build. That's true. It's the nubris build. Cause it did it better. Well, galvanic outbursts. Our outbursts are quite galvanic. That's the idea. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> it is getting excessive. Huh. Mal Maelstrom did push away the his deadly wake. Okay. G those, got got those, him? Things happened over there. <laughs> things are happening again. <laughs> those bullets don't quite know what they're doing. Those bullets are just... Hello, friend. Goodbye, friend. <laughs> Bullets don't know how to bullet near me anymore. Drone specialists. Uh, it's 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 way too late for you, emergency systems. Yeah. If I lose my shield, it's all over for me. Streamline. Why? Uh -huh. Uh, for, uh... Now, Discord Orbs. Oh, there you go. Now that's... That's spicy. Get another boost! There we go. Oh, God. I'm fast. <laughs> oh, yeah. I got a lot of orbs just kind of <laughs> winging around. It's a two-for-one sale. And it all must go. Everything must go. If 
Come on down to Crazy Lee's Drift Emporium. Where we got the two in the drift and one in the rift. Eh. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't like it. And just lazily sneak through space while you wait for things to show up. Uh, I got rampage. I can't be lazy. I gotta. I gotta go. 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 Yeah. It'll just spin in circles for a while. Or a Boris for a minute. Yeah. Oh, hi, Punchy. See ya. Whoo, boy. Well, there's Blink. Now we can potentially blink ourselves into and or out of tight spots. Yeah. All right. So the only thing I'm particularly worried about now is wave 200, I think. Because Seraph, Seraph 2 can be a bit scary. If you're not afraid of Seraph, one could be a bit scary. It's true. But Seraph 2 is quicker, and during the fight of Seraph 2, I'm longer. True. Which means it's, it, it gets harder and harder for me to dodge instant death. Uh, do you happen to know around what wave we're on? No idea. 185. Okay, so we're, we're, we're getting pretty close. Yeah. So, uh, if you can, try to give me a heads up around, like, wave, like, 195, 196, so I can prepare myself. I'll try, but I make no promises. Uh, but do you promise that you make no promises? Oh, yeah. But you just said... <laughs> well, there's 190. That wasn't a promise, that was an oath. <laughs> oh? Yeah. <laughs> that was a really dumb joke. Yes. Uh, what do I even want at this point? Uh, Dying Star. No. <laughs> more Galvanic Outburst. There you go. Or more Rampage. Uh, I feel like Rampage is actually going to be what saves me now. Do I can give you a little bit of Holland Shields back? Yeah. It allows me to stack up instead of stack down. Oh man, I'm crazy. Yeah, now. I was going to say, you're now at a speed where you can't really protect your head anymore, though. Yeah, you can. Look at that. Plus, I got the maelstrom going on. Yeehaw! Just zipping around. Plus, that's 14% more global damage. And 4% more hull and shields after you take away. Oh, boy. Oh, okay. Okay. We're just going to stay over here for a minute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to wait for those orbs to go away. There we go. <laughs> Not bad. Okay. Oh, shields are getting spicy. Okay. And we're and we're okay. <laughs> well, alright then. As long as we're, we play it careful, everything's gonna be alright. Yeah. I think he just, okay, he went off screen. I was like, did my Discord orb just punch him to death? Ooh, that's some, that's some slow down. Also, oh, it's a boost. Get that boost. 
Damn, your boosts have been very subdued today. I'm very tired. It's not, shouldn't really be a surprise. I feel like I'm always tired lately. Look at your Discord orbs just yeah. maelstroming themselves all over the place. Just wow! <laughs> That's doing great. Whee! Well, we broke a mill. Good job. So now the next milestone is can we... Can you high score it all? Can I high score it? Which I believe, if I remember correctly, is about 1.47. So basically 1.5 to get on the board. Roughly. You might be able to get away with just under it, but... Okay. As a conversion. Mm -hmm. I want to get a couple more scorching weights. Yes, now. you do. There we go. Now, now, now our wakes are scorching. <laughs> Things are getting serious now. Oh, Lord. All right. So, yeah, this this was... The, oh, hello. You're not supposed to be here yet. Okay, I got Whoa! it. Whoa! I got it. Oh. He got you. I knew he was going to kill me. I wasn't prepared for him to show yeah. up at 225. He just, he just showed up in the middle again. Uh, he was just like, this can't be a high score build. Like, this is not allowed. Snakes aren't supposed to shield. No. Well, that was a jerk. Yeah, that was kind of a dick move, game. Yeah, well. Uh, I couldn't position myself away from his orbs in time. But uh, that's how the build was supposed to do. Yeah. Putting aside hubris and actually trying to do your, the best you can. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's a pretty good build. It's pretty okay. I, I would recommend it. I'm not good at Leviathan, and I did that, so... 10 out of 10 would recommend. 10 out of 10. Maybe like 9 out of 10. Yeah? Yeah, it's like 9 out of 10. It's a little rough to get off the ground. Yes, but all Leviathan builds are. Yes. Uh, so there you go. Uh, hopefully that build is my redemption arc until I screw up next time. So we'll see you guys next time. Uh, goodbye! <laughs>